Hello, Danger Noodles. Uh, I have to do something real quick before we fully start. I gotta add back the alert box. I believe that's it. I don't know. It's very important that I do yes, this. Yes, it is. Okay. Uh, Alright, so now I have my alerts back. Because the bot stuff has pretty much finished. Alright, first thing is we're going to do two truths, one lie. Basically, you have to draw... Um, uh, one, uh, draw two truths. Uh, Jesus Christ, one <laughs> one. You gotta draw two truths and one lie. And at the end, we have to guess what the truths and lie are. If you want to write what the truth or the lie, uh, write what it is in a picture on the top, you can. That might help some people. <laughs> Anyways, we ready? Wait. Write what the truth or the lie is in the top? No, what I meant is, like, write what's in the picture. Like... Oh, right. With, oh, we're still drawing pictures. I was thinking I'd just yeah, be yeah, writing yeah. out something. No, no, no. I'll be honest. I'm probably going to write this shit out. That's fair. <laughs> I guarantee you writing. Yeah. Anyways. And... Also, I need to do something. Uh... Okay. There we go. Oh my god. In three, two, one. Create the animations first drawn. And by the way, um, uh, I've got a notepad in front of me, so if y'all want, I can keep track of gore. Okay. I can keep track of everyone's answer as to what the true or false and then tally up scores. Alright. This will be my first time trying to draw with this new mouse and keyboard. Yeah, I had to think hard for mines because I usually tell a lot of shit that happens in my life. <laughs> yeah, and you said it's two truths, one lie, and we have to figure out which one's the lie. Yes. Okay. Okay, that's good. All right, and it's on infinite, so no one has to worry. <laughs> I finished one of mine. <laughs> Oh, wait, there's a specific tool for trying to write? There is? Yeah, there's like a like little notepad tool at the side. Oh, that might have been, that, that might have been something new, because I heard that they updated something. Oh, they finally updated, like, text. That's cool. And it basically just gives you a really thin line to try to write with. Oh. Not like type in text. It's like we updated this just as a thin line to write with. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. oh, wait, maybe it's notes. Oh, I just noticed the good. second I click off of it, it disappears. Oh, that's right. That's for like animation, but since it's solo, it's not going to do anything. Basically, for animation, notes will stay on there, but it won't show up, like, in the GIF. 
it'll show up for the next person so they know what to do. Oh, okay. That's cool. Yeah, I forgot that's what it is. Yeah, that's it's actually really cool. But since we're doing solo, it's not going to really matter. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to go about my standard of using the various uh, shape creators to write. <laughs> All I'm gonna say is one of my truths, you aren't gonna believe me at first. That's kind of like 90% of your stories, honestly. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> it, it, it sounds so, un my stories have sounded so unbelievable, but they're true, <laughs> which is weird. It's like I'm literally living in the SCP universe. <laughs> right, at least you don't have my, well, you have, cl you don't have my, my, like, <laughs> thinking about it, you may not have my life, but your life is fucking weird, too, never mind. Oh my gosh, Bookworm, I'm sorry for this drawing, it's bad. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> How do I? Did they get rid of that tool? What tool? The fill tool. It may not be part of of the of solo. You know what? If it's not part of solo, then I'm done. I'm not coloring this in. Fuck that. Fuck that. Uh, well. Alan. Yeah. Watch like it be brought back in the next slide. I can fucking <laughs> Alright, so that means it's just hatch it. There's two people not done. Oh, it was three for a moment. <laughs> oh. uh, yeah, uh, now it's back to three again. <laughs> I was just checking something. Oh, okay. <laughs> and now it's back to two again. <laughs> huh. Looks like no fill tool in this mode. Yeah, that sucks. God, this writing looks like trash. I vibe with that. I'm basically only using the line tool for writing. So everything is in a very jagged font. Oh. I believe in you, Hatchet. I believe in the power of the hatchet and the butt buddy code. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> I'm not paying enough attention to care. <laughs> That's a perfect response. <laughs> What was that? The code outlined in the book buddy contract, of course. That's what Bookworm said.
Yeah, with how much time it's taking me just to write write this, I don't think I'm going to worry about making drawings. Yeah. I just used the pencil tool to write. Yeah, but if I do that, it'll be literally un illegible. Oh. <laughs> it's barely legible as it is. Fair. I don't care if nobody can read my writing. I mean, yeah, ultimately we can just narrate what's happening. True. Let's see. I mean, I kinda, Here. I'm kind of liking I this I so far. Do a little... I just... Yeah, there's no fucking fill tool. The only thing that selects about it is there's no fill tool, but other than that, this is kind of fun. Yeah, I like everything besides the lack of fill to like what why? That feels like it gets in the way of animating if anything. Yeah. <laughs> okay. My head is a diamond. Your head is a diamond? What? My head is a diamond. Oh. Okay. Uh, are you okay, Hatchet? My head is a diamond. <laughs> oh my god. Did, did you break Hatchet? What did I do? Maybe. You obviously broke me. Duh. <laughs> Fuck you. Just, let me just draw this very artistic rendition of a pig. Oh, wait. I just realized. Uh, Bokram, you saw nothing. You saw nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Anything new to report? <laughs> Bogan says, why is a cop in your drawing hatchet? You'll find out. Pray <laughs> why you're twirling a glizzy. Okay, so I I forgot I don't have it set to just Gartic Bone. On OPS, it would only allow it just Opera itself. So I went to go to the Tangia tag to mess with the alerts, but it flashed on screen. <laughs> now I give the pig a gun. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Right. Oh, Jesus Christ, the notes. <laughs> there's th there's note writing everywhere on my screen because I didn't realize what it was supposed to be for. <laughs> as far as I remember, notes don't appear, you know, in the GIF. The, yeah. Mm. Oh, jeez, I need to stop looking at your screen as well. Pop out chat. Pop out chat. Where are you, pop out chat? Okay. I just come on, come on, Opera. You can do it. Okay. Popo chat. You see, that's the thing. This is hard. This this is particularly hard for me, because I don't have an like I have an incredibly boring life. Unlike me. <laughs> now, like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? 
same wall says book yeah like it's at some point one of these is just going to be uh two truths one dare i have gotten a d in math class before that's fine Maybe i'm just some listening people find that exciting I'm just listing things that have never happened to me. Well, it's two truths, one lie. So two things need to be cor need to be real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Two truths and one lie. So two truths and one lie. know what let's get this out of the way uh this is one of the only vaguely uh stalking things about my life that i can ever bring up fair I just forgot how to spell wants. <laughs> I spelled I spelled wants, but with a W in front of the O. I mean, that's in that I dropped out of high school. <laughs> Maybe. ADHD moment. It is going to be so inconsistent, the capitalizations in the lowercase of my letters. Sometimes I'm doing lowercase e, sometimes I'm doing uppercase d's. Yeah. And I misspelled once again. God damn it, Hatchet. I, I forgot to put the C, so I just spelled one. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Hatchet. I believe in you. Yeah, I think this is literally the only shocking thing I can say about myself. Ah, the silence. <laughs> Just realized I probably shouldn't even spell out this word for which. Oh no. <laughs> we don't even know what it is. <laughs> Welcome to the silence of busy people working and thinking. And because of the silence, I hear only screaming in my head. Man, my writing sucks. <laughs> Same. The scream in my head is Jerry screaming. What? <laughs> the scream in the Why back of your head is No! <laughs> Oh, 
my writing sucks, so it sucks. <laughs> no, it was one of the screams. <laughs> it was very quiet. <laughs> that was me hiccuping. <laughs> a hiccup can be a tiny scream. What? <laughs> you heard me. You're weird. Yeah, you know what I was kind of thinking of for that uh, special video? Because I don't want to reveal what that video is on stream. Um, I was thinking, I forgot, I have like a shit ton of days I have off in November. We can just choose one of those days to work uh -huh. on it. <laughs> yeah. And didn't you say that uh, you were going to be largely cutting back on streaming during November? Yeah. Is it a bit of busy month? Collaboration with that shit. Interesting. What? <laughs> what, is, what does that even mean in this case? What is this then? I think what we're gonna say is that is that you you start making your channel <laughs> in stream. With uh, me. This looks awful. I hate everything about my life right now. We love you. I mean, I honestly hate myself every day, but that's fine. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, I have to read this. This is the YouTube comment on the extra called I just I have just ended sexism. That old clip when we used to have someone in the server. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um this comment says, I absolutely love how the video ends with women are cool, followed immediately by a video talking about the Sniper Wolf situation popping up as a recommendation. But I'm on mobile, um, so it takes up um, the whole video player. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you too, what the fuck? To be fair, um, a lot of times recently, uh, when I try to watch things on, on is is real doing the final solution. Yeah. It 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 starts with the ads of, oh look at how evil all the Palestinians are. Let us kill them. Jesus Christ. Although the onions really been popping off. I saw an onion uh, article. Everyone here knows what the onion is, right? Yeah, it, it's, it's fake, fake, literally like purposely fake uh, to get laughs. And it's kind of weird how some of those have become re real. One yeah, it's like those to become real, but you know. I mean, yeah, it's satire. It's intended to be cartoonishly stupid, but used to comment on actual issues. Yeah, and then, for some reason, in recent times, some of their articles have become real. Like, what? Yeah, like, one of the most famous one that, ones that comes to mind is, like, an old one that said something to the... T uh, that was, like, titled something to the tune of, uh... Um... It is journalism's sacred duty to endanger the lives of as many trans people as possible. What the fuck? And that's, like, that that article was made, like, right in line with a whole bunch of, uh, anti-trans articles being made in the UK. So it was obviously mocking that. Well, I saw a recent one that said, uh, something to the tune of, uh, 
Oh, you know what? Let me just go look at it. Also by the New York Times. Yeah. Um. Let's see. Let me just actually go to the Onion. Okay. Uh. Oh yeah, let's see. Uh, we got an an Onion article article that is titled "Biden urges Americans not to let dangerous online rhetoric humanize Palestinians." Oh, that that sounds about right for him at this moment. Uh, he actually believes Israel when they said, "Oh yeah, that Palestinian uh, hospital." Hamas totally did the bombing of that, not us, even though everyone saw us do it. Everyone everyone saw us do it. We were talking about doing it. But after it was revealed that was literally only women and children in there and medical staff, you know, we, we, we have to say it's not us because that makes us look like killers. The main we thing are killers. Yeah, the, the main thing I saw was, uh, like, just, like, the death toll hit the media, and that's when they freaked out. It was, like, at least oh. 500 people. A lot and of then, why do you start right as, as Hatchet says that? <laughs> and then... Like Hatchet talking about the media being stupid, the final Different game hospital. Oh, playing. Sorry. Keep and up. then just last night, uh you see, you know what? Let me just let me just tell you guys a story. You remember how like about a year ago, though or no, maybe a year and a half ago, there was a big story about how uh Russia was claiming that they did not intend to uh hit a church with missile with a missile while said church was harboring uh refugees like mm -hmm. taking in and taking care of refugees right and how everyone called that out as complete and utter bullshit um just yesterday or like last night uh israel dropped what was it four bombs onto the uh Oh, what was it? Uh, the Church of Saint Paimon, something along those lines, which was uh the third oldest Christian structure, yeah, Orthodox Church or something, yeah, the third oldest Christian structure in the world. Uh, turned to rubble, with and at the time there was a prayer session going on inside, and it was acting as refu as a place for refugees to stay. The hospital though, like there's been a lot of innocent people killed. It's clear that it, the Israeli government isn't actually looking for Hamas, who is the terrorist, and yeah. they're literally just killing innocent people instead of looking for the terrorist. They're just using him as an excuse to murder people. But yeah. they didn't really get in trouble for it until the hospital full of literally just medical staff, women, and children, because they literally bombed a hospital full of only women, children, and medical staff. But we should also probably try to tone back on that topic. Probably, That's a fair yeah. point. What do you say, right? <laughs> I said probably. <laughs> damn it. <clears throat> God damn it, my lungs. I said probably, yeah. Oh. Okay. Here we are. Our last thing we got to draw. Okay.
Okay, there it goes. Oh my god, this is gonna look so fucking bad. We don't have a fucking fill duel. That's okay. Don't worry, Bright. We're laughing with you as well as at you. Okay. Just remember, we none of us have the fill tool. Yeah, so this will probably. Why did I make this look like some weird ass vomit? I thought I thought you just always did that. I hate you. Don't make it so easy. Gier, you're supposed to defend me. That's my dad. As as your dad, I love you. As your dad, I love you. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, in all honesty, actually, I think both of my truths and no, actually, every, I, th I believe everything I wrote, no, you're not going to believe them. <laughs> Which is perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm making these look like fucking bowling balls on barf. <laughs> okay. None of my my drawings are that advanced, so if you're expecting more, don't. I'm not going to do more than like line art if I can help it when I don't yeah. have a skill tool. Yeah. Okay, before I write this, I got to make sure I got the right name down. Oh my gosh, the first thing that opens Safari is homo milk from Canada. Wait, homo milk? <laughs> homo milk? What? Yeah, there there there's milk in Canada. It's called homo milk. <laughs> that probably refers to hom homogenized or something. Yeah. yeah. That is Canada, that's not the way to talk about homogenized milk. It sounds different. It sounds different. What, do you have a problem with the homo milk? Hatchet, I'm sure I've had a lot of homo milk come out of me over... I should not. <laughs> oh. Pretend I never said anything. Oh, no. I'm far too honest. Shut up. <laughs> I can now predict one of Jerry's future truths. 
if you remember it by then. Book is bonking you. Look, I rarely say anything like that. Do I really deserve bonking? I mean, the bonking is indiscriminate. As long as you say something like that, you're going to get bonked around here. That's fair. It was a slip of the tongue. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Uh. <laughs> I'm putting my knowledge to the test. All right, mine's done. I actually had, I had to check because I wasn't sure, like, which was which. I was going to get things confused. And uh, one of them, if would cause well, I shouldn't say anything. <laughs> uh, Who just joined? What bright? Oh Aderna, hey. You're here earlier than expected. Oh, then you can technically join in for two truths one lie. You can like guess if you like. Let me add you to the scoreboard. Plus, we're, like, basically right at the end of the first round. Uh-oh. What? They left. Adana is gone. I think I'm getting better at writing with just lines. Well, I guess you have more improvements than me. Then again, I, I think my issue is just shaky hands. Yeah. I'm not sure how I can write like shit, but draw like smooth. Alrighty, so how are we going to, like, be, before I click done, how are we actually going to go about doing this? Like, we just let the GIF play, and then when the GIF is over, yeah, uh, we ask everyone's uh, like, voice. Like, which one do you think is the lie? Yeah. Yeah. I write, I write down everyone's choice, or everyone just remembers what they choose. And then I write down points based upon whoever gets it correct. And you said it's like one point per correct guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. And do we give time for people to explain them before? Or it should probably say after we do the choosing. Yeah. I think after the choosing sounds perfect. Yeah. All yeah. right. All right. To one, mine will be first. I've held a full-grown python before. Okay. I have five hard-to-see scars on my arm. At my elementary school baseball field is a hot spot for really tiny pebble-sized meteorites. Oh, Jesus Christ, the an- Oh, God! There we go. Oh. 
Hmm. But please, please add more time between the... I did, I, I put it for like 50 seconds. <laughs> Why does it say two seconds? I don't know. Oh no, I think that's saying like the um like how long the gif is maybe? No, it's definitely not two seconds. That's weird. But anyway, I'm going to say uh gods, all of these sound really plausible for you. I'm guessing the lie is holding the full grown python. Okay. Looks sad, so the scars are true, I feel like. I am going to go with the baseball field. Okay. And Book is still deciding. Book says, so I'm between Python and meteorites. You know what? I'm going to go from Python to Scars. Okay, you, you changed your answer to Scars? Yeah. Okay. Everything, everything. Then I'll go Python, so someone will get a point at least. <laughs> the answer, the lie was five Scars. Are you yeah! kidding me? I only have two. <laughs> Oh, uh, a pinch of the, fuck, a pinch of the truth. Okay. Yeah, okay, it's actually true for my school. I actually, because there's actually a science place in Virginia that studies space rocks, so I took a bunch of these rocks that, I, that looked like meteorites. Took them to them, and they actually confirmed them to be meteorites. And, um, it's like a huge hot spot so that, baseball field because I literally found 75 my entire time I was in elementary school. Man! It's, it's weirdly a hot spot. And when I went back, like, in my senior year of high, high school, like, to say hi to the teachers, I went back and there was even more. <laughs> like, it's oh, weird. Oh, why? I don't know. But I think it's, like, collected over time. I highly doubt it's, like, Bombarded. Right. I'm positive it's collected yeah. over time. People don't just grab tiny meteorites and dangle it around a baseball field. Yeah, but the weird thing is where they mostly hit is fucking Yeah, they still use the field. Um as far as I know. It is where they mostly hit is near the bleachers at the baseball field. <laughs> That's where the most meteorites are in the ground near the bleachers. <laughs> So I always imagine one day an adult is just staring at their kids playing baseball and they just get pelted by a space rock. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, give me a sec. I gotta type something out. They travel so far just to, to attempt to hit a silly human watching a small human play a game. <laughs> Welcome back. Hey, Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, Adurna, did you see the an Did you hear the oh, yeah. answer? What's on screen right now? Are you live streaming, Bright? Yes. I like to Discord. Oh, I am not. No. I can. I can go in Discord. Hold on. All right, so no one tell Adurna the answer. Yeah, and also Adurna, the uh, um, the room is in strain planning. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. All right. So my two truths and one lie is I I held a full grown python before. I have five hard to see hard to see scars on my arm. And my elementary school baseball field is a hot spot for meteorites. Which is, do you hey, think it's the one... lie? Okay, so the second one is definitely a true. Because you're uh, clocking 
you will get into so much fucking bullshit that that I can see that being true. What was the first one again? What was the first and last one? The first one. The first one, I held a full-grown python before. I could see you doing that, so I'm going to go with the third one. The lie was the second one. Okay. Yeah, I actually did get them confirmed at a, at, at a place in Virginia that studies space rocks. They actually are meteorites. <laughs> it's weird the hot spot. Like, I told a hatchet, jeering and bookworm. In my entire time of, of elementary school, I found, like, 75. And when I went back in the senior year of high school, I found more. <laughs> It it's definitely collected over time, but it's it's weird how that one area just collects them. <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't know probably, why I'm not a scientist. <laughs> probably due to something having it was probably something to do with the like um like where it is like um like magnetism or something. Is, like, yeah, or so. Uh, yeah, there's probably like some like reason. We're you gonna. Uh, so are we gonna do three rounds of two truths, one lie? Uh, well, I just did mine. Or well, I right. mean, like, like, uh, like three total rounds. I mean, we can if Darren wants. I again, and I. I was thinking after this, we go right in horror stories. God damn it. I have a fucking ad blocker. Oh, no. Yeah, that happened. Oh, there's a journey. Yeah. Oh, so you were just wanting to do fuck. one round of this? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, so I think only one person got a point. <laughs> yeah, is... Jerry. Jerry is the only one with a point from yours. <laughs> Jerry was wise to switch which one. <laughs> yeah. No. Well, I just thought it was fifty. Like, hmm, you were talking about the weird shit you lived through. Maybe I should pick the least suspicious one. Yeah. Also, I bet you can't even guess mm-hmm. where I held the full-grown python. Where? The public I library. Like told... I was gonna say I oh, feel like you've told sense. me this story, but that does not sound familiar. That- that makes sense because yeah. uh, libraries typically are like places where like mm-hmm. things like that can happen. So it makes perfect sense. Yeah, and um, they actually brought another animal in. I'm gonna tell you now, it was extremely docile and weirdly friendly for its species. What was it? Honey badger. Oh. <laughs> oh nice. Okay. Oh, oh, honey badger. Based. Badger, 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 mushroom. Yeah, mushroom. I even got to hold it. Nice. Was it smelly? A little. From what I remember. Yeah. Badgers are mustelids, and mustelids basically all have stink glands. Except for maybe otters. I don't know if otters have stink glands. But I was so weirded by it because it's it was so docile. Yeah. <laughs> Should we but save anyway. these? Or yeah, uh, yeah, maybe save these. Yeah. All right, downloaded it. All right, next one we gotta guess Jerry's two truths and one lie. All righty. I hate that of the dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Okay, so you hate Echo the Dolphin. I love the Pina Toki drink mix with lemonade. And I, I'm guessing it's used to think snakes at work just okay. Yeah. Yeah, so I used to think snakes were just okay. Okay. I'm not buying the bottom one for a second. Eh, I'm gonna go. Hmm. 
like the top one is pretty like I don't even know who. Like, oh, go ahead. Oh, Echo the Dolphin could be like a, a local thing or something. Yeah, at no, my Echo is... the Dolphin is literally a Sega video game character. Yeah, I I know oh, that. Okay. Yeah, I was about to say I have no idea who the fuck. I think when it's Echo. When you is. played I... Echo, you basically played as a dolphin, and at the end, you find out some shit about like being weird. Space dolphins or something. Oh. No. I think. By the way, this too... is this is a fucking, uh, this is a fucking killer dolphin. By the way. Yeah. Also, <laughs> I think two's the lie. I was thinking two as well. I'll go with one. Just All right. Be different. All right. Let's bookworm. We're waiting on bookworm. I'll tell the answer after bookworm. Bookworm says like one it. as well. So we've got two ones and two twos. Well, it looks like Adurna and Bookworm both got points. Damn it! Damn. Why is yeah, Echo was, the I Dolphin? Was, I, was, I, love, I used to love Echo the Dolphin. I loved playing that fucker. I, yeah, I used I was, to really love dolphins, so Echo, being able to play as self a dolphin, murder fish, oh, yeah. swim around, it was so <laughs> fun. <laughs> I love the. Oh, yeah, that sounds I, really fun. I love the extra detail of murder fish as a bonus. Well, well dolphins <laughs> eat fish. You have to murder fish to eat them. You can't I mean, eat yeah. You don't kill. Also, I I do love uh Toki, uh the Toki drink mix with lemonade. If you don't know what Toki drink mix is, that's okay. It's not American. Oh. And I used to think snakes were just okay. Finding out that I was a snake made me look into them more and like them more. I was just thinking, the fuck? I am not snake, but I am snake. I just did not know snakes enough. Anyways. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna say I was a hundred percent guessing that the uh second one thing that I didn't understand was uh something Latin American. I yeah, know it was. De it's definitely an uh, American. Yeah, because yeah. of the pronunciation. Yeah. All right. Everyone ready for hatchets? Uh, fair warning. Uh, this is going to be very hard to read. Maybe I don't know. But yeah, I'm ready. So. Right. Well. So uh. Okay. Yeah. Oh my God! You can see the the note thing. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Hatchet, who's the, the the guy right over here? <laughs> who who do picture? you think that's in? I can't say his name. <laughs> who do you do? You, okay, there's two people. Who, those are two historical people that have this mustache. Which one do you think I'm talking about? Charlie Chaplin. Not him. The other one. <laughs> All right. A failed artist That's from it. Austria, <laughs> whose house should be turned into a porta potty. <sighs> Anyways, um, so you, but yeah, you my, oh, you want to read it? Uh, yeah, my, 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 my list is: I've nearly been arrested before, with a very artistic rendering of, <laughs> uh. Me nearly being arrested. <laughs> uh, I once kept a list of that guy's quotes with me with the list and a person saying rightfully what the fuck. And I took a year of chemistry in high school. Oh, wait. It doesn't show up in the GIF. <laughs> oh, the writing? Oh, that's okay. That makes sense. So it's just the images. Yeah, just the images that shows up. <laughs> That's funny though. That we can see the, the freaking squiggles. <laughs> All right, make make your guesses, folks. Which one is a lie? Okay, so I 
I think the list of quotes. I think one. You say, okay, so book says, hmm, somewhere between two and three. I go three. Okay, so, uh, okay, I so, uh, okay. so, okay, book says three, so just to figure it out, uh, uh, Bright, you said one. Yes. Uh, Jerry said two, and yep. those two said three. Okay, uh, the correct answer is three. Fuck. God damn it. Yeah, so, um, I think I'm gonna start with the most problematic one oh, to yeah, explain yeah. first. Uh, I used to be, um, an edgy centrist wannabe, uh, yeah. who was obsessed with collecting information from every source I could think of. I did, like, it, it, it wasn't about the quality of the source. It was about oh, yeah. the, having as many sources as possible. So I have a book where I was, like, writing down, like, quotes of, uh, like, historical people. Uh, as, oh, yeah, book says – I did remember you saying something like that before, yeah. It's like a book where I'm writing down quotes from historical people, and in that book, uh, from that particular section of my life, there is literally a page where you read, oh, this is nothing but MLK quotes, and then you flip the page. Oh, and it's no. nothing but the failed artist. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. It, it, it felt like a fucking shot to the gut when I found <laughs> that journal and started looking through it, because I did not remember <laughs> writing that many quotes from the guy. <laughs> Oh, no. I have since moved on from this. Uh, this is one of, this is quite literally one of my biggest, one of the biggest things that I'm ashamed of in my past. <laughs> Not the kind of MLK. Yeah, there was a good, there was a good number of MLK quotes in there. So it wasn't all bad. It's just, uh, I was mm -hmm. dumb. I was a very dumb high schooler. Uh, the second, or the first one there, I've nearly been arrested before. One time, my friend Vernie and I uh, didn't know what the crime of vandalism was. Oh, no. Uh, so we went to a local bar and found a whole bunch of beer bottles in, in the dumpster and just had a bunch of fun breaking them. And then a cop showed up, explained to us that what we were doing was quite illegal and rather than arresting us, uh, he simply uh, had us clean up the mess because there wasn't any permanent damage. It was literally just a bunch of broken glass on a bunch of rubble. Oh. Yeah, but the thing is, is that, like, there's two major cops that go around in my in my town. There's one older guy that's generally more laid back slash lazy and one younger guy that's uh, very gung-ho with crime and punishment ag aggressiveness. Uh, mm -hmm. We were very lucky to have gotten the old guy that showed up. Yeah. And uh, third, uh, yeah, the, the, my, my school did not offer chemistry. Oh. But as a side note, I'd simply like to point out Old guy just wants his donuts. <laughs> I'd simply like to point out that I had fun drawing this simply because I thought it was so absurd uh, to include H2O4U as a chemical in the chem chemistry <laughs> class in high school. Uh, do y'all know what that is? No. Danger. Bad. H yeah, H2O4U is a chemical called... Uh, uranium dioxide peroxide. Oh. It's a radioactive acid. Dear God. Also known as never drink if you want to live. <laughs> Book says what, really? It was mandatory in my school for juniors. Yeah, no, it was just Same. not an option. My, like, my school is tiny as fuck from a small town, thus it's underfunded as fuck. Mm-hmm. Mine, uh, I think it might have had chemistry. I didn't take it. I took chemistry, uh, for college, though. 
That gotcha. Was fun. So, uh, Book and Aderna got a point there. Alright. Here we go. Here's Bookworms. Everyone ready? Yeah. Yep. I feel like Bookworms going to be the hardest because we don't know much about Bookworms' life. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, never had surgery, okay. Oh my god, what happened to that man? <laughs> never read Twilight. <laughs> I'm assuming. And took a trip to Ireland. Oh my... Jesus, okay. Listen. Listen. Poor buddy old pal. <laughs> that third one. I wasn't going to guess it was Ireland. <laughs> if I had to guess what this is, I was thinking it was a dog shitting out a toy plane. <laughs> oh, God. Same, same. I was gonna like literally. That's what it looked like first at first, and I was like, "Oh, okay." Okay. Like now, I can see where you were going with it, but it looks like <laughs> looks like a dog shitting out a plane, and said plane oh, is being oh, jettisoned. I see it now. Why did it... <laughs> jettisoned oh. toward like a stick and a leaf? <laughs> <sighs> Anyways, um, I guess I'll go. Uh, hmm. I want to go three. I'm going one. I'm going two. Well, one of us is gonna I'm, win. <laughs> I'm going with Jerry on one. All right, all right, Bookworm. What's the answer? She's the lie. Yes! It was, it was three! Damn. Okay, so the bird... Oh. Damn it, I thought you would... Thank you for I, following Getty sure. Wiki. Oh, new follower? Cool. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm I'm sad now. This means that I'm the only one who didn't get a fucking point. <laughs> to be fair, I'm pretty sure I didn't... Well, I seen more. I got a point from Bright. Yeah, the... Like assuming this to be our last, uh, our last run, I I I want to. We should do another one since I'm here. Okay, yeah, if you, you want to do that, wanna... we can. I can do that. Or or we could do like three rounds or whatever y'all want to do. Maybe just like try to speed it up rounds. a touch. Three rounds. Okay, that sounds fun. And hell, it's not like we're gonna run out of spooky thon, uh, streams where we could do the spooky. Uh, the, the horror stories if we don't actually get to it tonight. Yeah. Because this is actually really fun. I like this. You like Two Truths, One Lie? Yes! I actually yeah. brought something into Garthic Fun that you guys enjoy. I've been trying to find other things to do. Because <laughs> this is fun. I get, to, I get to learn things about my friends. Yeah. All right, we can do an, another one. Two doors one light. We got this. All right. Would would have said down. never went to the hospital, but technically of being born in a hospital. <laughs> That'd be a massive technicality, yeah. <laughs> but uh, anyway, at the end of the first round, uh, the scores are, uh, uh, Jerry and Bird are tied oh, for second God, place. Yeah. Uh, with one point, Book and Aderna are tied for first place with two points. Alright. Let's do this. Alright. Oh yeah, and I'm I'm dead last. I'm a loser. You ready? <laughs> well, yeah. No, no, you're, 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 you're in third place. <laughs> there. <laughs> Three, two, one. Thanks. Oh, do you want me to change the timer so it's actually faster? Faster with doing what? I thought you said you wanted to go back. Oh, wait, never mind. No, I, I don't. I, like, adding a timer like, generally just this makes, like, it makes it bad. Cool. Okay. I'm just meaning, like, like it, it, would, it would be good if, like, we, we, we all kind of collectively said, let's try to do this a touch, a touch faster. Right. Basically. Alright. Three, two, one. Okay, so two truths. Because, like, the first round took an hour to get through. Okay. 
I basically have already exhausted the list of things that I think are interesting about my life. Which is sad. One of them is be me being ashamed of myself when I was in high school. And the other was me being a dumb kid committing vandalism. My life is boring. Ooh. Oh, this'll this'll be fun. Gonna keep it to the theme of Halloween. I mean, my first one is horrifying. But for, I mean, for you mean for this round? Yeah. I was about to say, for last round, your first one wasn't horrifying at all. It's just big snack. I will say the python was heavy as fuck. Because it wasn't well, like yeah. the ball python. It was like, I think this piece was called a Burmese python. Well, yeah, like a full-grown python, but as like you were describing, I, was, I would assume it was heavy as fuck. Yeah. Those bitches is thick. Yeah, it was actually kind of cool because I got to feel its actual muscle and how strong it is. Yeah. All right, hold on. I gotta check something real quick. Cause I don't want to fuck this up. A oh, book says I just didn't bother making a picture for this one. That's valid. Yeah, Derna, we basically decided that drawing a picture is entirely optional. Sorry, I was AFK with this. I mean, yeah, kind of same. Because I like drawing shit things. Wait, I might draw something small in the corner. Yeah, you got time. Like, literally no... Well, everyone except for Bright is, is still working. I finish. Thank you. What... Okay, that's, Bright. That's, that's bright. Exactly what, that's bright. exactly what Hatch said. I just said the statement. Everyone but Bright is still working. What do you think that statement means? Shut up. <laughs> also, 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 you're still streaming. If if you don't want to stream in no. here, if you don't want to stream in here. I mean, it's not like I'm outright writing down lie or truth. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Just just in case the uh, the chew hops in and wants to see what's happening. Say. Hmm. Sure, I might bring it back. I'm doing two truths, one lie. Don't say anything, food. Spoo just well, starts yelling out, that oh, thing. that's bullshit. Ooh, that's hilarious. Oh, man, we have the spood lie detector. It's this book. Did, did you just call spood a lie detector? Yeah, because it's the idea that, like, laughing at the thought of, like, spood walks in while you're doing a drawing, and they just immediately audibly go, that's bullshit. They, they didn't say that. Well, yeah, I know, but I, I'm I'm just saying, like, I, I, I pitched that as, like, a funny possibility.
Yeah. <sighs> All right. Yeah, my next one's gonna be Halloween themed. All right. So, uh, how's everyone right now? Urine. What? I'm just Lost glad. Lead. <laughs> I'm just glad my body situation is fucking gone. What situation? The body situation. You know, the one thing that we were worried about. Oh, the botting! Oh! Oh, yeah. That's the question I want to ask Adurna. Do you still want to be a mod, or do you want it taken away? Because I don't mind you being a mod. I'm just wondering. Then you would get... You would... Oh, you're fine with it? Okay. Then you would rightfully get uh, upgraded from... Uh, which clipper to which mod status in Discord? True. Oh my god. What? The fucking cat thing. You did redeem a thing, you liar. Maxwell has come. All right, I am going to draw the most underwhelming ape I possibly can. Hello there. Hi, bookworm. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what was that? Oh yeah, Aderna, if you're wondering, uh, we found out that apparently in this mode, uh, we do not have access to a fill tool. Unfortunately. Yeah. It's the only thing that sucks about it. I'm just spinning hot dog. Wait, that means I have two spinning hot dog shits in the fucking Tangia. This is the twist. I think when Bookworm gets bored, they spend 50 cents on Tangier alerts. <laughs> All 50 cents per pop. Yeah. <laughs> I would like to place $100 on 50 cents Tangier alerts. <laughs> Hey, 
technically, if I want to get across why this thing was the thing, I probably shouldn't be making the world's most egregious depiction of a of a gorilla. You got this. I believe in you. All right. Drawing a raptor would be way harder. Also, I'm happy to announce that my awful gorilla is T posing. I if what was that? I was just laughing at that. Fire red emblem Looks asked me. Interesting. Jarvis, what is the meaning of life? Am bored, so please help me. Ah, uh, the eternal question of life's meaning. Well, if you're bored, why not contemplate the mysteries of the universe? Or perhaps engage in a fulfilling hobby? As for the meaning of life, I'm afraid I have no profound answer. But hey, maybe the meaning is to find your own purpose, because relying on an AI for existential guidance seems a tad excessive, don't you think? Oh my god. I really what? wish there was a zoom in button. <laughs> Welcome asked what the meaning of life was to Jarvis. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's something I need to work on. Probably on my day off. I'm going to redo the AI thing. For my own voice, so I don't sound like I'm whispering into the microphone. <laughs> also, um, and he <laughs> said maybe I shouldn't ask an AI something that profound. <laughs> um, I was gonna mention, I like in the circles that I follow. Mm -hmm. Um, I have stumbled upon what may or may not be spoilers for the next chapter of uh um Andy and Lele's coffin. Oh. Oh. But the hey. spoilers that I stumble upon is literally just it gets more incesty. <laughs> oh god damn it. Oh god. Sweet home Alabama. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's implied that their relationship is not just uh, emotional, but uh, go goes into the actual stuff. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Wait, does it Maybe imply you guys shouldn't play that game anymore. Uh, no, I'm still playing it. Okay. I mean, it's not 18 plus. Yeah. It's, it's purposely got fucked up theme. Wait, what? Wait, it shows it. Oh, it shows the. Okay. Yeah, it just shows the background. You don't have to worry about that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's a button next um, to the notebook where you can just get rid of that. Okay. I mean, if, if Bright or y'all wanted to stop it, I mean, go ahead, but. I don't see much issue with it. It's it's a really big game right now. True. And honestly, if there was a really big issue, Twitch or YouTube probably would have said something. Yeah. <laughs> Most of it's just implied stuff. Okay, that's good. That's slightly good. Hey, Scream, <laughs> this is your friendly neighborhood. But yeah, it does touch into, you know, fictional depiction of not this that one you see so on like obviously if also, people are uncomfortable seeing that this is the truth do not listen yeah. to the imposter this tell lies to theme for that what'd um, you say oh i said just don't come for the stream for that i hate you bookworm what Did you say oh. 
What did Kenji do? To the stream for that. They used my voice to say I am a cat bird. Damn, Perfect. Good job, book. And you said you just won't come to the stream for that? I don't know. No, I was telling people who have, like, oh, uh, issues okay. with that, just so don't come to the stream. Yeah. I'm trying to remember. And establish that her recording is the real one, and she is the fake one. I'm trying to remember. What's a good Halloween memory to use? But yeah, if, if that if that makes anyone uncomfortable to watch that game, we're going to have to put that like content warning at the start of it again. Because uh, it gets more... <laughs> Oh, okay, no one. Doing all right, Jerry? Yeah, why? I, I, I just, like, in the back of my head realized the subject matter that I brought up might be triggering. Uh, why? I mean, I don't know where you're where your triggers would be. I wasn't sure. It, it, all. It's not with incest? All right. Like I've, I've, I've seen a decent number of people that even though they don't have that literally having happened in their life, it becomes a trigger for them just in general. Well, it's not a trigger for me. It's never happened in my life. I gotcha. have no reason. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. I don't want to make anyone uncomfortable. Oh, shoot. Wait. God damn it. If I actually made my drawing too big. What, were you making the drawing before you made the Prompt, caption? Yeah. yeah. That's really dumb. I know. Now, what do I draw for this? Uh, I know the perfect thing. <laughs> Big white man with a chainsaw. Oh my god. Can, what can up? I ask? I I decided to look at the thing where you know when they tried bot on YouTube and it failed. Yeah. As of right now, it it, it looks like a heart rate monitor. <laughs> you know that little beep thing. Oh no. That's what oh, it looks no. like. <laughs> I can't get it out of my head. <laughs> Just beep. <laughs> Hello. 
Oh, also, otters do have stink glands. I looked it up a bit ago, but forgot to mention it. Oh, okay. Yeah, then I guess all mustelids have stink glands. Neat. What? What? Meow. What do you want? What do you want? Kitty wants to be involved. Shut up! Festus makes Festus sounds. Could that be heard through my mind? Festus yelling? No. Nope, but it was adorable hearing that Festus was probably yelling at you. He's still yelling. Festus! What's your problem? Huh? What's your problem, dude? I made my my second drawing even better <laughs> with just a few words. <laughs> now he's lounging on the back of the head of my uh, recliner that I'm sitting in. Oh, well, that, that is just great. <laughs> Book says, OMG, this j drawing looks janky. All drawings what? must look janky. I want to work on that on my day off. What? Oh, just out of nowhere, three copyright claims on one vi uh, VOD. Oh, come on. It was on an indie horror game VOD, too. I guess and everyone's having trouble deciding what what their two tooths and a lie are. Yeah, I don't no, think so. No, I'm drawing. Uh, <laughs> I ain't having trouble. Well, no, you're not. Because basically, what I'm doing is I uh, am like making a list of three individual things to. Uh, um, like, be a list to pick from which one is the true one. Yeah. I just realized that I'm, I forgot. You know what? I can still make this work. I can still make this work. What did I you realized, I, I realized that I forgot what we were doing because I was going to make it so that uh um yeah i was doing it backwards like i i was going to make it so that like uh i my my first one is a question being asked and i was going and said question is like yeah i was i was about to do two lies and one truth instead of the <laughs> opposite oh my god but I can still make it worth work. I can still sort of make it work. Okay. Kind of. <laughs> Somewhat. Anyways. Yeah, uh, I can't unsee the heart rate monitor thing. So I decided to send it to you guys. It, I can't unsee it. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like... Killed it. 
Deep. <laughs> you might too do a struggling for his life. <laughs> Yeah, but I still find it funny how YouTube gets rid of bots faster than actual troublesome creators. Yeah. <laughs> the fucking SS Sniper situation. Yeah. They've yet to really do anything. <laughs> well, what they did was a, 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 a minor uh a, a, fuck, a fucking minor demonetization. Like, literally the lightest slap on the wrist possible. And then she walks back and says, I'm sorry. And then that's it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, Bookworm. The illness of the bots versus the doctors of YouTube trying to save it. Oh no. When no one decides to pull the plug on this planet. Patient. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> hmm. I'm definitely not scrolling Twitter and looking at things. Or are you? Okay. Festus. Festus. What do you say? I don't I don't know why, but I literally made my second picture a meme. <laughs> the way it looks like you can't take it seriously. <laughs> Y'all hear that? Yes. Yes. Festus. So that's the truth. God, I didn't say it was a truth or a lie. Oh, now on to our last one. As we know, all memes are fact. I hate myself. I'm trying to think of a scary memory because it's Halloween themed. Hmm. Oh. Um. I think it's best I not say the implication. Oh no! What? What's up? Why are you uh, doing? You'll, you, you'll see. Oh. Thinking, 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 And I also realize that this one's going to be kind of easy to guess, depending on how well you've paid attention to the shit I've said before.
Yeah, but I'm pretty sure you guys can get the implication of my last one. <laughs> Also, I know if, if you just joined the stream right now and this is what you see, I am sorry. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I'd be looking. No. <laughs> I want to see your reaction at the end. Second thing. Really, book? What book That's say? Stitch. They did scare Mama. bright. Oh. Why do I keep getting fucking emails from Adam and Eve about, like, free golden rabbit shit and dildos? <laughs> because they think you're a woman who needs their, their happy center. Happy center. Alright, I'll drink. I drink to bookworm. Right. Right. Yes. For the love of God, what did you just say? I drink the bookworm. <laughs> it's drank. And I stretched to see the bookworm. The word <laughs> you're looking for <laughs> drank. <laughs> Every day you force me to question my. <laughs> Face. Because how can there be a god? <laughs> Bookworm says, is drinks correct? Lol. <laughs> no, no, drink, no. <laughs> Loki probably loves messing with grammar. Probably. <laughs> I want to put a pastor. Oh, uh, yeah. I actually did saw a video about uh, uh, Loki myths and uh, Viking mythology. I forgot. Uh, Norse mythology, not Viking mythology. Norse mythology. Yeah. Um, and I found out... Uh, when he killed Baldur, I think his name is. Baldur, yeah. yeah. The fucking other gods <laughs> made him watch his son eat his other son? <laughs> yeah. Oh my well, god. That's... <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure that's not like... Well, it, it depends on your interpretation. Basically, that's recounting the... Uh, the... The potential future sass possible past of Ragnarok having happened. Uh. Because Loki killing Baldur is what kickstarts Ragnarok. Hence why the 2016 God of War game set in Norse mythology is basically an extended commentary on you killing Balder. Yeah. I caused the end of the world. 
Ragnarok is not the end of the world. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Do you? Yes, yeah, you told me it isn't. Oh, really? I remember you telling me it isn't. I I remember shit. Some shit. Not all of it. But some shit. <laughs> I was about to I was about to call Cap. I remember shit. No, you don't. <laughs> you don't remember Jack shit. Well, I don't know everything that goes in Ragnarok. I don't remember everything you told me about it, but I know it doesn't mean in the world. Yeah, it's it's uh, alongside the fact that it's kind of questionable whether or not Ragnarok was in original Norse lore at all. Fair. Yeah, there's people who believe it might have been added so they could have a Jesus figure. Oh my not, god. Well, the it's it's less likely that it would have been like <laughs> consciously added and more likely that like interaction between Norse tribes and Christianity gradually caused it to become an element of it well people were guessing that because whoa one the religion was recorded by priests well yeah oh. the well that's the thing like the only obviously there's the issue of the fact that the only like major recountings of like myth like the norse or the prose edda that's the main one, the Prozetta. Like, and most other retellings were specifically uh, done by Christians, but the uh, um, Poetic Edda was almost certainly written by a, a pagan, and they also included references to Ragnarok. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. So the the most likely answer is that if it wasn't originally in the practice, like it it just gradually became a thing as a result of uh, intermingling with other cultures. That like literally the same thing happened with the swastika in Norse practice, because I I learned that like at around 500 AD the swastika was actually regularly used in association with Odin. Yeah, wasn't it also at some point used for a symbol of peace or something like that? Yeah, it was basically picked back up on uh at the turn of the century when people started like finding more Norse ruins as well as interacting more with uh I think Hinduism. Mm -hmm. And uh, Buddhism as that... is the one with the swastika, the one yeah. in the proper angle. Yeah, and that's the, that's the other thing. The um, like the forty degree tilt that the uh big bad guys used is also yeah. not present in the historical uses in Norse culture either. In fact, like literally one of our earliest uh, items that like archaeological artifacts that we have that is associated with a cult of Odin uh, uses like the proper uh, swastika. Hmm. It's History really interesting for anyone watching. <laughs> It's really interesting. It's also infuriating as a Norse pagan mm -hmm. to find that one of the like 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 the the big bad guys mm -hmm. like those fuckers like appropriated so much from Norse culture. But one of my personal favorite symbols from Norse culture, they also happened to make the most common symbol of their thing to the point where now there's just really no way to reclaim the swastika for Unless European like, like in, in Europe. Yeah. And even then like with the recent Europe or like the US. Yeah. Like, e like even then like with and even then like with the recent rise in 
Indian fascism, it's becoming questionable about the use of the swastika in that context as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Book was the last one. They're still thinking. Yeah, you're good, Book. Yeah, you're good. It's okay. You're good, Book. And it's like, it's it's just, it's very frustrating. Very what frustrating. The, what, wait, how the fuck did, what? 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 What's that? Did, like, YouTube just, like, get, get rid of all of them when they came in or something? Oh, yeah. No, like, every time, like, the bots came onto the channel, YouTube went, eh, no. <laughs> That's why I said the, oh the joke God. how they take care of bots better than bad creators. Um, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's oh. looking like it looks. In, it's looking like each round of these, uh, uh, well, two I, truths, one lie, are going to take around an hour. Well, I can do one more round. Yeah, I was thinking that I as well. I don't know After if this. like they like gotten rid of this like thing but i found like i did find like a uh a a youtube channel that has a kids that is like ha that has a kids like is named after like another kids channel oh and, yeah it was it had like uh they had like more NSFW content. Jesus. Mm hmm. <sighs> Elsa Gate never I, stopped. I, well, no, it wasn't. It wasn't that. Well, it yeah, was, I know. <laughs> it was worse. It was way worse than that. Oh, oh. worse than the stuff from Elsa Gate. Yeah. Right. Uh, yeah, there was a playlist I saw at YouTube at one point that that uh, appeared when I was seeing if anyone else did Dead Pepper Pig in North Korea watching fireworks and whatnot. Oh no! So I did that, right? And I and I see a playlist and it's just a bunch of Peppa Pig clips. I was like, okay. So I look through, I see a bunch of Peppa oh, Pig no. clips, and then I see, um. Clips of videos from a certain hub in the playlist. Oh no! Yeah. That's not funny. That sounds like whoever made that was trying to trick kids into watching. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the, the, the thing is, that's the same thing that with the like that channel. Yeah. I think. Yeah. So I, I probably didn't have any like sexual content since like well like yeah, since that would get that would be more likely to be banned off of there, but Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we can't I forget that you. one groomer that YouTube for basically refused to ban for like years. Right. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Here we go. Everyone ready to see mine? Technically, unintentionally, I did make my first one scary, even though no, I wasn't trying. All right. Okay. Here we go. I've I've got the scoreboard ready. I drove through a Category 3 hurricane. I almost uh, got shot by a cop on Halloween. <laughs> and I told off a guy in a in a white van at age 8. I couldn't say the actual situation. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. So, okay, so I'm going to say first one's a lie. The second one I could definitely see. The third one. I could definitely see happening. So, I'm going to say first one. I so will like, mention I will mention that uh, I ad adore the characterization of yeah. the pig holding the gun upside down. 
because uh, that's about the firearm safety I'd expect from Virginia police officers. <laughs> no, <I'm... laughs> All right, so Derna's said... one. Okay. That uh, Derna's one. I'm yeah. gonna say. Mm, I'm gonna say two. All right, Hatch I'm gonna two. say two as well. All right, Jerry's two. All right, Bookworm, what's you? It's the final book down. Oh my god, you're like my alarm. <laughs> One seems almost seems almost too mundane. Like a category three isn't the worst, like someone could almost do it. Uh one. <laughs> so you think one's the lie? Okay, so two so we've got two ones and two twos. Uh mm -hmm. two's the lie. Yeah. yeah! I got a point. Yeah, uh, I did spin for a bit, but I survived mainly because I actually hit the Eye of the Storm through most of the hurricane. And Eye mm. of the Storm is actually the safest part of the hurricane. Bright, yeah. you lucky little fucking shit. Yeah. Also, Bright, in the future, well, don't say... Okay. Don't, like, when you... Or just real quick. Bright, in the future, when you're writing down... Or when when you're making your intro, or making a prompt, don't start by saying, "Trying to th think, what's one of my more scary memories?" Because you said that with the third one. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, so also, I figured that was a hundred percent going to be real. Also, right. when you like when you talked more about it, you made it clear that this was. A real one, so... Fuck, I didn't think about that. But yeah, um... Yeah. <laughs> the only reason I didn't go in the van was because they said, Hey, you want some candy? I had a toothache, so I said, No, my to my teeth hurts. And I started walking away, so it's like... <laughs> and they say, You want to help me find my dog? So I said, No, I already have one. <laughs> and then went inside. <laughs> I was being a... <laughs> so me being a fucking moron... <laughs> You this stumble. Is mean, but I'm glad you were such a stupid kid. You stumbled. <laughs> like, like this is literally the like um like the absurd, like the maximally absurd version of how you stumble through puzzles. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like you just you just stumble your way into success. <laughs> and in this time you stumbled your way into less trauma yeah <laughs> or possibly being dead yeah. yeah stumbled away from death alright save that one ready for Jerry's yep yep I hey got, Hatchet I you got, actually got a point exactly. yeah I got a point Why those spaghetti <laughs> Okay. Yeah, well, oh, wow. Spaghetti is a Korean uh, food place. Uh, Not Korean, it's uh, an Asian. I don't know what. Uh... Sorry. That's oh, okay. wow, that looks weird. Wild spaghetti, to to describe it better, it's Asian style spaghetti. It's like they they do a few. Let me let me just link. I have a feeling they have a uh, website somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, you probably don't want to go further because you might have a way that w whether it's the truth or not. Um, well, I I don't see how you know like from seeing. No, no, based on your description, I mean. Well, yeah, that's why I stopped trying to describe it because if I tried to describe it, you'd know if I liked it or not. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I cannot find their website, so I'll just put the the food in in recording. Well, hmm. All right. So the first one is I don't like wild spaghetti. Next is my favorite pizza is New York fold and hold. 
I just realized the link is literally on the. And you like drinking Roy Rogers. Wait, what the hell's grenadine? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a. Uh... How can you not know what grenadine is? I've also never heard of this. <laughs> well, think of this. Have you ever had a Shirley Temple? A Shirley what? Temple. Shirley Temple. No. No. I don't drink. I mean, I drink vodka. Uh, it's it's not, so Shirley Temples can be non-alcoholic. So oh, okay. Shirley Temples are actually traditionally non-alcoholic. Oh. <laughs> okay, but bookworms got the person who drank it was originally a child when she started drinking it. No, nah, but book says a sweet syrup made of pomegranates. Oh, okay. Uh, my oh. choice is two. Grenadine isn't actually. Just, uh, just, uh, it isn't just pomegranates. Uh, pomegranate. It's actually yeah. other things too. Mm -hmm. It's just the cheaper versions of grenadine tend to use pomegranate instead. Uh -huh. But not all of them use, uh, okay, so let me think. So the first one, it could. Hi, Zanju. Hey, Zanju. Okay, so. Uh... Oh, wait, that's their spaghetti? Okay. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. Me, like, just having to use photos because. Apparently, Google doesn't want me to look at their goddamn website. <laughs> yeah, you see, I've oh, got I've got this issue because, like, in my brain, we've got like we've we've got Jiri saying, "I like this thing, I like this thing, but I don't like this thing." And in my brain, like, I have Jiri marked down as the most positive person. That it's hard for me to conceptualize Jerry not liking something. <laughs> well, I can see Jerry not liking something. Well, I mean, like food-wise, um, not like general concepts. Okay. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm probably gonna go with. Hmm. I'm drinking Roy Rogers. Okay. Eh, I'll go with the first one. I'll say that one's a lie. Yeah. Oh. I'll go with the same thing. Also, now that you know what wild spaghetti looks like, there is a Roy Rogers. Oh, yeah, no. Um, I think, yeah, I think that one's the truth one, personally. Or the the lie, you mean? No, oh, the truth. The Roy Rogers one. Oh, the Roy Rogers is a true one? Okay. Yeah. And here is not the best example, but a good example of an okay example of New York pizza, you hold and fold. Alright, Bookworm also says two with me. Bookworm's with me in two. Um, okay, I'll, I'll go one. Yeah, I was gonna go... Um, you could, I could go one, I could go three, but I feel like I'm gonna go one. Yeah, again, it's just... It's just hard in my brain to imagine Jerry not liking a particular food. <laughs> well, the thing is, uh, raw spaghetti is the place. So Jerry would be saying that he doesn't like the place, right? Well, I would be saying I don't like the food at the place. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know what? Fuck it. I'm, I'm going with one as well. One is the lie. I mean, everyone knows Jerry's a five-star chef. And that's why they love so much food. Did everyone choose a yeah. number? Yes. Yeah, we all chose. Yeah, so uh, I and Aderna chose one, Book and Bright chose two. Well, Book and Bright are right. Yes, I think damn it. Pizza is not New York pizza. It's actually uh, deep dish Chicago pizza. Okay. My mom yeah. is from New York, 
she was born in New York and everything, but that does not mean I need to like her 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 state pizza. Well, Chicago's in New York, but shut up. <laughs> wait, what? No, wait, what? No, <laughs> Chicago's not in New York. What? Wait, what? is it Chicago in that state? No, 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 it's not. It's not. Chicago is in Illinois. <laughs> oh. New York is in New York. <laughs> there... There's a lot of things around New York. I get confused sometimes. <laughs> okay. They're like okay. literally the distance of the Great Lakes apart. <laughs> Anyways. You think I've been to Chicago? <laughs> I've so been funny. to what? Like Nevada, California, Hawaii, and New York. That's it. I still think mine is has the most uh scary thing so far. <laughs> what? Right, no offense, right? I wasn't adding scary. I literally did I know. food, food drink. I know, I was being a yeah. dick. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to have to give a clarification because I need to basically verbally change uh, one uh, of, like, my, my quote when, when we start, but okay, let's go ahead. Three, two, one. Okay. My... Why? Okay, for a second it just froze. Okay. Okay, so I forgot that this is two truths, one lie, and I started doing two lies, one truth. Oh no. So pretend that that thing that says my first horror game was uh, actually says uh... Let's mm -hmm. say a a a horror game that uh developed my appreciation for horror. Let's go with that. If PJ's King Kong, yeah, Peter Jackson's King Kong, uh, on on the GameCube, got uh Resident Evil Seven Biohazard, and I uh I drew. The worst rendition of Jim Baker possible. So, and amnesia. Okay, so these are like. So, what is. Uh, what does the Resident Evil have to do? Are you saying. I think they said they played it. Right? Okay, so the. Like, so, like. Let me, let so me reword. The horror game that gave oh, you appreciation. It says they're so. going to reword it. Thank yeah, you. it's like. Okay. Two of these games heavily, like, heavily influenced my appreciation for horror. One of them didn't. Okay. Which one didn't influence my appreciation for horror? I don't want to say... God damn it, now I want chicken nuggets. <laughs> I'm going to say, uh... I want to guess one. Three. So we got mm. Jiri with three, right? With one. King Kong is a horror, horror game. game. You can't change my mind, says Sanju. Oh yeah, Peter Jackson's King Kong is definitely a horror game. Mm -hmm. It is, it is, it is one hundred percent survival horror. At least when you're not playing as King Kong, like the majority okay. of the game is played as Jack little piddly human on Skull Island rather than Kong. So, I'll do two. Two? Mm -hmm. Alright, bookworm. Okay. Got bookworm. They said bookworm three. Bookworm goes, goes with three. Okay, and you know what? Let's just have a little fun. Uh, Zanju, do you want to give a guess to have honorary points, even though you're not actually in the players? <laughs> Which one of these horror games was not a formative game for my love of horror? They we'll say... go with two. Okay. So, just to recap, uh, Giri says 
one. Wait, I said three. Oh, did you say three? Who said one? Bright yeah. said one. I uh, said Bright one. Bright said one. I said two. Brooke said two. Well, Brooke said three. Sanji three. said two. And then Jiri said three. Yeah, all right. Okay. Uh, book says I thought wrong. I mean, I haven't revealed it. Do you want to change your answer? Uh, maybe. <laughs> uh, okay. No, it's fine. Uh, okay, the correct answer is three. Three? Okay. I have never played Amnesia. Fuck. I was right! I knew it wasn't two, because you've talked about liking Resident Evil 7 to me before. Resident well, Evil 7. Is, Resident Evil 7. Is, I was, oh, go ahead. The reason I chose that was because you said it was, like, part of your foundation or whatever. Yeah, formative. Formative. So, like, I was like, okay, so what if you put it like that because it wasn't, like, a formative part, but, like, it helped with his appreciation more or something? Yeah. So let let me let me describe the process here. Uh for the majority of my life, I could not engage with horror whatsoever. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm and then I got my first game my first game console being the Xbox, the X I was about to say Xbox GameCube. <laughs> what is wrong with me? It's a new console coming out. <laughs> and the Nintendo GameCube and on said Nintendo GameCube one of the first games I played was Peter Jackson's King Kong, thinking this is going to be, you know, just a standard fun thing. I like dinosaurs. I like Peter Jackson. He's one of my... Box Cube. Help the difference. Uh, you know, he's one of my favorite directors. I, I like him quite a bit. Uh, and then I had nightmares for several years. Oh. <laughs> because that game instilled such a primal sense of anxiety in my brain uh because it's it's very resource intensive and you're constant like literally every corner is around every corner there's a different weird ass creature that wants to eat you and i was a very young kid when i first got introduced to this Looking back on it, it's not the scariest horror game. But it's the horror game that caused me the most fear because of when I played it. Yeah. It's also just a really solid game in general. It's absolutely incredible. Yeah. Uh, that besides sense. that, RE7 was the horror game that got me to actually playing horror games. Because I, I, I played King Kong, was terrified of horror games for multiple years, and then, uh, Trespasser, a game based on Jurassic Park, was part of the reason I didn't like horror games, and it isn't even a horror game. I was just scared of the dinosaurs. <laughs> um, but yeah, the, uh, I had like this massive stint where I just didn't play horror games. I hated horror games because he, one of my favorite games was kind of horror, but it hurt every part of me. So I avoided horror. And then Resident Evil 7 is what really made me realize, wait, you know what? Maybe I should go back and try horror again. And Amnesia I've never played. Amnesia is actually not that bad. I played a little bit of it. It was actually pretty good. I I can actually Amnesia play it with basically Game Pass. It's very old. And there's many versions of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I've also never played it. Yeah. I thought that was a good one to add because I know that like I know for a fact that's one of the most commonly pointed to like formative and revolutionary uh horror games for people, but uh Dude. I just haven't played it. Yeah, and it's also the game where Mark Plyer's meme of Tiny Box Tim came from. Oh, yeah. But yeah, anyway, so I need to actually tally up points. I forgot who picked what. Uh, I picked one. I yeah, picked, picked three. Yeah, so, and both so, picked three. 
Book yeah. and Jiri got that those points. Yeah. Book and Jiri got <laughs> points. <laughs> Book and Jiri are strongly in the lead right now. All right, now for the Ooh. hardest. Now for the hardest one, because book we don't know a lot about book. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Keep my <laughs> simply the scar. Oh shit. I'm good at video games. <laughs> yeah, I can see. I have that. not watched many Jibby movies. Ghibli. Ghibli, Ghibli movies. movies. Yeah. I think it's number three. I'll go one. I'll go two. <laughs> yeah, I'm going two. I'm doubt. I'm <laughs> doubting bookworm skills. <laughs> I'm not gonna doubt bookworm skills. All right, I think that's everyone, right? Yeah. So I recap. We got <laughs> uh, Bright and I are on two. It was two. Lol. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. I, I I vaguely remember Book having made jokes about being bad at games. Yeah. <laughs> Why did I have a symphony and not give them a scar? The only thing is, I well, actually have Vant, I don't think. Given well, my own sibling a scar, so I don't think. I did have a sibling. Oh. 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 Sorry. And they did give me a scar. Oh. oh. I was... I actually don't know where I got my tiny scars from. I, I got, like, one on my thumb and one in, like, the elbow pit. Like, it's not, like, on the elbow. It's, like, on the first side where it bends bends down. Oh. What do you yeah. think? I have... I actually have a birthmark there. Yeah. Everyone knows what I mean by elbow pit, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Would you be what what else would you be talking about? There's a pit behind the like in the elbow. Okay, book says one my sibling was on my bed when I didn't want them to be. They were getting off my bed very slowly, so I pushed them off. They hit the open broken dresser drawer at the bottom of the ladder. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's the nicest. That's Ooh. nicer than the worst thing I've done with my sibling. Yeah. Boo. What? 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 What horrible things has Jerry done to you? Boo is not in the room. Damn it! Damn. <laughs> so not intentional, but still kind and of. I was talking yeah. about my blood sibling. <laughs> oh, okay. Valid. Yeah. Yeah, I have a feeling it's it's true because uh, th those type of movies don't usually come to America that often, like in movie theaters. Yeah. Hmm. Also, I didn't know you had seen many Ghibli. Yeah. Uh, book has not seen many Ghibli, but anyway, let let us continue. I think, Adorno's I think first... my favorite movie out of that genre would be Spirited Away, if anyone knows that. Oh yeah, no, I've seen it. Yeah, I, yeah, I love it. it. Ghibli uh, isn't a genre. What, what, oh, I mean genre. Movie I movie meant company. Oh, oh, oh no! Look, yeah, Ghibli. Uh, Spirited Away and Hell's Moving. We need to help Bookworm more Ghibli. <laughs> it's I mean, more than I... Yeah. More than more than I've watched. Really? I have not watched a single Ghibli movie. I think oh, I've also, I forgot. I forgot what the the name of the watched? princess was, but it was it was Princess something. Princess Mononoke. That's what I watched. Yeah, yeah I watched that one too. I've like watched I think two or three possibly. Oh no! Oh yeah! I also watched. Uh, what was what was that like? Cute little one. Um, it says though I remember seeing. It says I remember I seeing ads for Ponyo and Arati as a kid. Ponyo, yeah, Ponyo. It was Ponyo. Ponyo. Honestly, I would love to have like a, a Ghibli session of just us watching the movies. At some point. Sanju says Totoro and Pon Ponyo. I would honestly oh, yeah, love I've, to I've do that. Totoro and I've watched Totoro Ponyo 
I've also watched uh, Spirited Way and How's Moving Castle as well. I um, think I st- that might be it. I still love the factoid that when uh, when uh, the director of uh, Totoro was working on getting it localized to America, there was talks about changing Totoro's name. And there was, like, a big variety of names that was, like, Joe Toro, and uh, there was one that's just Craig. <laughs> uh, and then the director at one point made the statement, um, I decided not to change the name because I would not want to be named Craig. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Joe Toro. Oh no, like Joe as in Joe Biden and then Toro. Two different names. Yeah. Like like first and last name. Not well, Joe actually, Toro. About that Craig thing. Uh I bet the Vanos crew wish they didn't meet a Craig. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh wait, what? isn't Mini Lad? Is Minilad's name Craig? Yes. Uh, well, rip. Oh. Okay. F to all the Craigs. Well, let's go to Aderna. Let's get to Aderna. Yeah. Yeah. Let's. This let's, let's actually move on. after Aderna, because I didn't realize how late it was. I thought it was eleven fifty one, not twelve fifty one. Yeah. This will be last. We should definitely do this again, though. Well, yeah. We did too. I thought we would do. I know, but I didn't realize the time. Yeah. yeah. I thought it was 11.51, not 12. Yeah. Okay. So you had double pneumonia twice as a child. I have never learned how to fight. I have loved the Dallas Cowboys. Number three. Yeah, I go with Jerry. <laughs> I was going to go with three, too. <laughs> this book is going to be an out- outlier. <laughs> What will Bookworm choose? Also, hmm. listen, since since we've been generally uh, poking fun at each other's drawings, uh, if this football actually existed, yeah. that company <laughs> would need to be sued. <laughs> it kind of looks like it has a butt at one end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It it looks like it got fucking ran over by a tractor. I I I'm Maybe also it did. I'm also Maybe looking did, at the yeah. lungs and I'm seeing eyes, like those weren't supposed to be eyes. Those were supposed to be like little like black dots in them. I know, yeah. but I see that. Sure. But I also see eyes. <laughs> at least you didn't say anything about boobs or some shit. I'm not that shallow. Yes, you are. Yeah, <laughs> Fuck you. you. Are. <laughs> yes, you are. Every time you see a character in a video game that has boobas, you just go, "Oh, hey, boobs." Uh, book says, "You know what? For the meme, I'm gonna make it unanimous. Choosing three. Uh, okay, everyone <laughs> chose three. Wait, wait, so Sanju. Wait, if Sanju, if you're here, yeah." Are you, do you want to choose? Yeah, yeah. Zanju, do you want to choose? <laughs> do you want to be the Oh, outlier? yeah, we forgot. To, oh, yeah, fuck. We, we we forgot to ask if you want, wanted to choose with Bookworm. My bad. Oh, uh, yeah, our bad. We forgot. <laughs> Everyone uh, choose three. Uh, three. <laughs> Everyone's in on three. So okay. let, let's hear it. Is three the lie? You're all wrong. God damn it. Damn it. Two is the lie. <laughs> I just don't picture you like Oh fucking brain. hell, my brain. I also never pictured you learning how to fight. Yeah. No, so, you see so that's I... the th- <laughs> No, you see that's the thing. In in my head, Aderna is the sort of person that like looks real innocent and like harmless. But would put like a four hundred pound man on his ass. 
Like, that's what I have in the back of my head. I mixed up what the second one was saying. Oh, no. I was thinking it was saying that Aderna has learned to fight. Oh, no. Well, okay. Oh, I'm so the dumb. Is, so, the reason I said that was because uh, I've taken Jeet Kune Do lessons. Uh, oh. Uh, so, I've, I'm like a... I think... What, what, what am I? I don't remember what belt I am. Probably like a blue belt. Yeah, I'm like a blue belt in Chikundo. Oh, hi, Mr. Cheese. Welcome, Mr. Cheese. The stream's almost over. So I have have learned how to fight. I haven't fought anyone at all. Um, That was the first time chatting. They come right at the end. Yeah, that's unfortunate. And also, yes, I have had double pneumonia as a kid. Yeah, I remember that one. I remember that one. I feel like you've mentioned it before. Mm-hmm. Oh no, I, I probably have. Oh shit. And also, yes, what? I I do... Okay, so also, funny thing, Hatch, hmm? I actually do have that necklace that I that's in the picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I can at least show my stream manager on the stream. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Also, wait, does that for, for wait does that have life. personal info? No. Oh, okay, good. it just says stream okay. info on it. Okay. Okay, so about the like um yeah, go the ahead. last one um yeah I've I literally have a like I literally like. Since I was a kid, I had like probably at least two or three, two, at least like two or three, well, at least like two things in my room that were Dallas Cowboy. Mm-hmm. Like, that was a Dallas Cowboy thing. Yeah. And I actually still have one on my wall. It's like a, fra- a framed thing. That I got like at a local thing here, where it has like um a good member number of the like historical players and stuff, and also one of the coaches. <laughs> Bookworm. Now we got a beef since I'm in Eagles in Eagles territory. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. All right, let me bring up my camera so I can take a picture of the final scores for verification purposes and or harassment of right purposes. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> oh, yeah, because Bryce is the... Is, Who has the most points, lost, anyway? Um... Oh, uh, it, that would be uh, you and Book, I think. Oh. You probably have like four, both of you. But then I would lose since you know how to fight this book. Why is my phone not cooperating? <laughs> there we go. No, don't don't take a picture of me. I don't want that. Book, book. Funny thing, I actually am a pacifist, like a personal pacifist, like yeah. But I, I, I'm a personal pacifist who loves swords and loves bows, and I don't know why I love. <laughs> okay, let me. Yeah, I can beat somebody up with the fucking blade of my, <laughs> like, well, like, this is like kind of like. The two swords I have are, like, not sharp. So, like, I could just wallop them with yeah. them. I also, I also carry, like, uh, drumsticks on me at all times, so I can wallop people with drumsticks. Yeah. All right. All right. Percussionist. Final scores have been set. Okay. The, in first place is Bookworm <laughs> with four points. Nice. In, in second grade... 
second grade. <laughs> second grade. Second place. In second place is Jerry and the Bird tied at three. Oh, fuck you. And in third place is a Derny and me tied at two. Oh. Mm-hmm. And Zanju oh, last. <laughs> Sanju didn't. Well, Sanju doesn't count because Sanju wasn't here. For... Yeah. Yeah, just uh, Zanju is at the bottom with an honorary zero. <laughs> Uh, Zanju <laughs> didn't get any points. <laughs> you know what? We'll give Zanju. Z- Yay! <laughs> you know what? We'll give Zanju a mulligan since we forgot to ask them on bookworm. Yeah. So Zanju has one point. Still Actually, wow. you know what? Fuck it. Zanju has twenty points. Zanju wins. <laughs> <laughs> the the winner of the first uh the great Doctor Bright. Two truths, one dare, Gartic phone game is Zanju with 20 points. <laughs> I feel like oh my should, God. this is... I had a feeling this might have not turned out well. This actually turned out way better than I thought it would. Honestly, like, do you have any major plans for coming streams? Because, like, if we could do this tomorrow, I would love it. I would also love that because I feel like we didn't really get pitch anything. And I can yeah, actually stream the, earlier tomorrow. But we can yeah. do this tomorrow. These do take more time. We can probably dedicate... do like two rounds tomorrow than do writing horror stories. Yeah. Zanju says, I dedicate this victory to my cat. He also wins by doing nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the great <laughs> Dr. Bright's two truths, one lie game, where the rules are made up and the points don't matter. <laughs> I mean, when you think about it, that's all games, really. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Out of all the truths I said today, what was the most surprising? Mm-hmm. I was actually, I was actually None of them. Um, honestly, not. Yeah, honestly, like, Bright, you see, that's the thing. You have created like such an expectation of your life being the most batshit stuff happening mm-hmm. at all times. There's no way to surprise us anymore. Yeah, just think of what your family tried to do. Then, then ask us, do you expect us to be surprised? I thought the like, meteorite thing like, would be a bit surprising. Like really. all of your, Like, all of your stories are the perfect in-between between, like, my gut feeling is this is complete bullshit, and... I trust my friend, so this, so, so I, I assume they're not lying to me. Like, if, if I was listening to your stories as anyone else, I would just say this is bullshit. <laughs> I think, I think the most fucked up one was my, my third one at the very end. <laughs> Well, yeah, that one's objectively the most fucked up. You know what? Tomorrow I will bring Nightmare Two Truths and One Lie. Good. Yay. Anyways, I love I love being scared. But yeah, you won't be scared. I'm gonna shit my pants and cry. No. Do it right now. Don't, Don't make me do it. My life isn't scary, Hatchet. It's just I uh, I am like slightly bothered by bright baby going like Yep, I have the scariest laugh out of all my friends. Oh. Well, that I was will awful. prove her wrong, I will prove her wrong. <laughs> Book says gonna cry, shit your pants, maybe, maybe piss and cum. <laughs> Yeah, That's we're gonna, stupid name. We're gonna raid Juice B again. Okay. So uh, I... what? Oh God! I still have that Onion article open. I <laughs> I closed the game and immediately it's just Joe Biden's disappointing face staring at me. Oh my God! All right. Good night, everyone. Oh, Jerry, before you go. There's this thing that on Throne that you do like on certain holidays. Uh, the holiday like a few days ago was like 
uh, I think it was like National Plushies Day or something like that. And the person that got sent for me is kind of like a Secret Santa thing. They oh, okay. sent me, I kid you not, and I love it, a Plague Doctor plushie. Oh. Hell yeah. It has that little lantern on it. It's, it's adorable. I'll send a picture when I can. Nice. Uh, it's adorable. Anyway. What are raid words? Uh, um, raid words are... Bees or Q? Uh, oh. G Jerry says goodnight. Uh, raid. I said raid, words. raid words. Bees are cute. Bees are very cute, but I think we need better raid words. <laughs> Should it be something bee related? Just sweet. We, we uh, do that sometimes. I got it. Okay. No, wait. I have an idea. What? Welcome, I'm scared. <laughs> let me let me just go let me just go search it up and grab it. Are you fooling the B movie script? <laughs> no. Not at all. <laughs> oh my I would God. never bring up the B movie script. <laughs> I can tell you're fooling the goddamn B movie script. <laughs> we can't send the entire B movie script this it's a fucking <laughs> Yeah, there's Twitch character limits. Well, I'm not... Who said I was gonna do the whole thing? Oh my god, Patch. <laughs> and who said I was gonna do the B-movie? It could be something other than the B-movie. <laughs> You're laughing so I know what it is. Why why not they be Bori on copy pasta? Because that might count as sexual harassment. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's actually one thing I, I was thinking of. Uh in here. Uh I think for my debut, because I'm gonna I'm going to stream till I complete Resident Evil 7. Because I have completed it in a day before. I've done it. Yeah. But I was thinking, I create a group chat of all people who would like to be on date in the debut. Both VTubers and non-VTubers. <laughs> okay. I forgot to tell you. Oh no, if Jerry left before I can tell him that. Oh no. So, uh... There's, there's our raid words, everybody. <laughs> According to all known laws of aviation, there's no way a bee should be able to fly. They're gonna be if so confused. Be to get that little body off the ground. The bee, of course, flies anyway because bees don't care what humans think is possible. Okay. That's, yeah. that's our raid words. Let's do this. Oh my God! Wait. Okay. Did I? Okay. Ooh, that's really good bookworm. Thanks for adding the emojis. I'm gonna copy that. Oh yeah. Let's do this. Night Sanju. Night Sanju. Good night. Oh wait, what? I actually pinned it. You pin I was about to say <laughs> you pinned it. Sorry, I didn't mean to pin your message. Yeah. <laughs> but actually, that's fine to pin. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna pin it. <laughs> Boom. Boom. I'll buy pin bookworm. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't hit the raid button because of the goddamn fucking pin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, You're now welcome. I can. Wait, why is it not saying I can raid? I can raid. Okay, everyone ready? Yeah. 